All right, let's see how this works out. I'm trying to do it with a tripod. Um, this is the first of the decks, and this is the, the brown deck. So if you see this brown deck, you'll know what you're playing. And we're going to try to do these very efficiently. So what this deck does is it utilizes the Aiel cards as well as a combination of white, red, gray, and brown to defeat the opponent. This is the list of your gold cards. And what this deck does is it efficiently and very proactively detains the opponent from being able to do actions while also simultaneously giving you a tremendous environmental advantage, resulting in you getting assured dominance over different territories to the opponent. Much like the Aiel do in the stories, the Aiel quickly navigate into a terrain completely devastate anything that is a form of resistance and take charge very efficiently. This is the Aiel in Fires of Heaven at this point in the story. So everything that we've seen up until this point, the battle of Jenga, or the, the battles within Jenga Pass, as well as the battles of Karian are represented in these decks. What the Aiel do are they efficiently and effectively take control over a territory while also stopping the opponent from being able to mount up any form of defense. Now, the most obvious and glaring weakness of the Aiel deck is that the Aiel are, in a way, fragile if they are alone, while strong when they are playing together. So, your best bet whenever utilizing this deck is to take territories extremely quickly before the opponent has time to respond, and respond accordingly if the opponents have decided to start mounting up pressure in other places. Unlike some of the other decks, this deck tends to favor a drastic amount of knowledge base power. So avoid any of the locations that feature any type of knowledge debuff and stick more to your locations that have your entry hazards. With your separate entry hazards, like, uh, like potential and ancient wisdom, you'll be able to not only simultaneously negative the opponent's political score, but also boost your knowledge score. Take advantage of all of the knowledge base power that this deck provides you with, giving you access to easily claim cards like Ruidian and the Aiel Waste for quick early grabs for points when you're trying to get a best 3 out of 5 game. By utilizing things like the Illuminator's Chapter House and the Stone of Tear, you should easily be able to take out opponents quickly with the deck known as the Aiel Rush deck. The brown deck is yours to play at JordanCon 2022.